Gone are the days when you are left alone to raise a child all by yourself. Did you know that you can now collect child support in Jamaica? Yes, 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 you can. You can now collect child support in Jamaica. So if you are a parent taking care of your child all alone, financially, you have the right to collect financial support. And that actually started back in 2005. If you didn't know, you know now. So here is some information on it. So this child support law, right? It requires every parent to take care of their child financially up until the age of 23. 23, 23. I mean, you would assume up until the age of 18, but no, it is up until the age of 23. And if that child have a disability for some reason, then that means there's a possibility that this assistance can go even further. So here, that tells you, if you're in that situation, you're raising a child all by yourself. And we all know how hard it is to take care of a child. There you have it. You can actually file for child support through the family court in Jamaica. Okay? So here's the thing that I learned about this. And this one I feel is very, very interesting because if by any reason the father or mother, depending on who is raising the child, because you all know it's not women alone that is single parent. We have men that is also single parent. So if you are a mother or a father raising a child all by yourself, and for some reason, the responsible parent is not able to, to do their role financially, the court could actually consider the grandparents yes they can consider the grandparents to jump in and help out to financially support that child yes i was shocked too when i heard it so nowadays when you're ready to have a child you have to really really think about it because you don't want to have a child and not be able to take care of that child, right? Because if you're not able to take care of that child, more likely your parents will be taking care of that child for you. And that is not, that is not a good thing. That's going to, uh, there's going to be a lot of upset grandparents out there. Okay. So these are things to think about when it comes to, uh, having children, but I just want to throw this information out there just to let you know that that type of help, that type of aid is available to you. Only if you want to take advantage of it, only if you want to take advantage of it. Okay. Now the big question of the day is how do I file for child support? How I could really use that help. I need that help. How do I file for child support? It is actually very simple. All you have to do is to go to the parish court in the parish that you reside and apply there. Or you can go to the Kingston and St. Andrew family court and apply there. I am going to put all the emails and telephone number, as much information as I can in the description box. So I'll make it easy for you so you can go there and gather the information. Or you could just look it up online, okay? I'm getting all of this information online. I am bringing awareness to you, okay? And I'm bringing value to you, I hope. If I am bringing value to you, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and um, share this video as well because I do know that there are plenty of people out there who could use this information. Now, here's the thing. After you have applied through your parish court, okay? the court will go ahead and send a summon to the parent in question with a date to show up in court. If 
by any reason that parent decided, ah, nope, 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 nope. I'm not going to no court. Me not go no court. No, no court. When she have five child support for me for? Hey, hey. If by any reason that person, that parent in question, refused to show up, it can actually mean jail time for them. So if by any reason you receive a summon to go to court, make sure you show up. All you have to do is show up and talk this thing out because at the end of the day, it is to benefit your child. At the end of the day, it's all about the best interest of your child. So just show up in court. So a lot of people think that when you have to go to court, it means that you need a lawyer Uh, -uh. in Jamaica. We always like to think as soon as there's court involved, then we need to hire a lawyer and we don't have any money and all that kind of stuff. Well, no, having a lawyer is completely optional. You don't need to have a lawyer. All you have to do is step up into the court, fill out your paperwork, and they will take care of the rest for you. It is as simple as that simple, easy peasy, just like that. So there you have it guys. If you are a parent in Jamaica and you're struggling to take care of your child, because we all know how difficult it is to raise children alone. My God, talk about the money. The money is tough. The money is tough. We all know that. So if you can get that help that you need to support your child by all means. Take advantage of this, okay? Take advantage of it. Also, there are other ways to, you know, to collect child support from a parent that is residing overseas, but I am going to leave that one for next time. I will fill in more information about that next time. But for right now, I'm going to stop this video right here and then I'll come back with more information and more details on how is child support granted in your favor. I will tell you what they're looking at, you know, to qualify you for that money and, um, and how to prepare yourself really for this. So stay tuned and uh, make sure that you hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.